And I've never lost sight of, of where I'm from and, and being a Midwest kid and, and having the opportunities that I have. If nothing else, Jamie Carroll is an Evansville guy, so it was only fitting that he joined former Aces head coach Jim Brownlee and Andy Bettis in having his jersey retired two weeks ago. I take a lot of pride in knowing I grew up in the area and, and grew up you know, seeing the program and understanding it and getting an opportunity to play here. It's a core of who I am. I mean, this is where you grow up, and when you grow up, you're shaped a certain way by your experiences. You know, I'm grateful for that. Knowing that my brother's the coach that has continued to really keep it more close at heart. He's so deserving, uh, both on and off the field. He's a great advocate for the University of Evansville and represents our baseball program uh, extremely well. To be one of three numbers retired is pretty remarkable for our baseball program. We're really proud that he's one of ours. This jersey retirement comes less than a year after Jamie stepped away from pro baseball completely. Following a 12-year major league career, then seven more years working in the Pittsburgh Pirates front office. I have my twins that are 14 that are getting ready to go into high school, so I've decided to play dad. Walked away from baseball in October to spend more time at home, coaching my son before we hand him off to the high school coach, being around. I realized I've missed a lot of things. I want to be home for that. That's what life is now and I'm grateful for uh, you know what the game has given me the opportunity to do that. Walking away has also allowed Jamie to reconnect with one of his true passions, University of Evansville baseball, as it becomes more of a fixture with the Aces, at least in spirit, on their championship run. Jamie's just really been there for us a ton. Um, he hasn't physically been in the dugout, but you know, he's always sending us messages. He helps the, the coaches with scouting reports and all the stuff like that, you know, so he, he just really gives his input everywhere that he can help from. When he is here, he's also a great help. He's, it feels like he's just a part of the team. Oh, he's helped us out a lot, you know, just helping uh, us as professional, uh, from professional development, trying to help us as coaches just get better each and every day, how we work, how we communicate with our players, just helping us get prepared to play our opponents. He's been our biggest fan all year, that's for sure, but he's also been an integral part of helping our, our program have success this year. This team is a lot of fun. It's a special team. They talk about it at the end of like championship runs. Uh, the team has a special culture. There's a lot of good chemistry. So it's common when you see championship teams or teams that have success. And I, I see that in this team. They root for each other. They cheer for each other. They have a lot of fun. It's been fun to be kind of more involved in it and be around it and experience it with these guys. So this is a lot of fun and I hope people come out and, and see it for themselves. Carroll would go on to play 12 years in the Major, making style of fame. And with his number retirement,